Okay, we're looking at this game today. This is another game from Nextfest. This is called The Crust. Sadly, it's not a bread baking simulator. It's the crust as in the crust of uh, the planet of, um, the, well, of the moon. So uh, this is coming out in Q1 2024. It's by a developer called VM Studio. I am sorry. This is so polished. It's it's gleaming. It's it's a little bit buggy. I've had some really like bad um, blockers. I think that's more to do with RNG than anything else. Uh, so yeah, we're going to check it out. It's a, a colony building game, and it is beautiful looking. So let us dive into it, and I'll show you it. Okay, as always, as it mentions, it's under active development. They've got a really active Discord, though. It seems to be a really friendly lot offering like advice and insights to the game. And it says this game's been in development for four years. That's, uh, wow, that's a long time. So let me just set this up and get going. Okay, here we go. New game. And we're going to watch all the intro because it is really good. And I totally didn't expect what we are about to see. There we go. Space elevator, Midway Island. These fascinate me. These are like, why are we not doing stuff like this? An elevator into space, so you don't need spaceships to get up to the uh, uh, lunar orbit. So here we go. So these are the cargo containers. These remind me of space. Oh, what's that TV show? It's a little bit before my time. Space 1899 was it with the Eagle Craft? Very reminiscent of those. And that's a logistics hub we're docking with. And then we're launching these onto. I think each of the red circles is a lunar base. We are landing. Okay, so this is where we are coming in. We are coming in to land and try and get permission to actually land. Right, here we go. Yeah, we don't want two weeks of downtime. Right, so look, look at this. How cool is this? I don't know what's up there. That's where that's just come from. Okay, I can hear you. Right. We need a deal. So I can move around like this. Alice is haggling, I guess you'd say it. Robert, you and I got off on the wrong foot. Our drones are designed for autonomous construction and repair. So we're gonna we're gonna help by doing our own power, basically, when they, they agree. So yeah. Okay, so 
we need to land our cargo pods here. So click on the cargo pod and click where you want it to land. And ditto with this one. So one's got supplies and one's got drones. Watch these though, they're so cool. Oh, look at the engine, the engine burn. That's so nice. And they essentially drop that off and then off they go again. So here's me little robots. Yeah, right, so first thing we need to do is build some solar panels. So if we go to construction, electricity, we need to go to on this. Director, place holograms of solar panels on the allocated site. And we go to solar panels, I think it is. Yeah, solar panels. So these ones, medium solar panel, and we need to do four of them. So you can do R to rotate them round. I just need to copy the pattern that they've got. Let's see if I hold down shift, if it lets me build more than one. It does, I love that. So we're building four of those. And this takes quite a while to do. I'm gonna stick it on fast. And I, I know we need to build batteries next, so I'm gonna skip ahead like a terrible, terrible player. So we're gonna build four of these next. I'm interested in you can click on these and see what you need. Steel and silicon. So we're building all of those. So we've got to link all we've got to link all this up now as well. Yeah. We've done already, we're already on top of this. We need to link all this up anyway. So let's uh click on this and do some wires. You'll need to get to the grid. So you got these shades have got like a spur slot to connect. Uh, I think I just need to connect my own up though. So let's just daisy chain these and then connect these to the batteries. Battery to the battery, battery to the battery. Perfect. Four connected and we also need to build a charging station and this is where we are going to, funny enough, charge our things. And then that needs connecting as well. So, we'll connect it to the space elevator and connect it up to that. That should be all, should be all done. Oh, so you can do it in there. Oh, okay. Okay, so look at the production on here already. What are they making? I don't even know what that even is. Anyway, I've already done that bit, but it wants me to do it. Should all be connected that. Well, we might need to connect this to this, so let's connect that to that. I think that's all lit up. Right, so next thing, we need to go underground. And we need to build us a drone reconfiguration module. So this basically will take the drones from mining mode to the other standard mode. So I am going to be building that. So they're going to be bringing me all the bits. We need steel. We need smart concrete and components. You can press tab to switch between them. And they're collecting all these resources from these little bits. Okay. A few more bits to collect. We should be good get good to go. Here they come. Here comes the uh, smart concrete. And then these are all gonna have a little party and build this. Yes, yes, yes. And now this needs wiring up, so let's try the right click thing. So we'll wire it to the elevator. It's connected. Oh don't you worry about that, we know how to do this. So we can we can we can reconfigure the the standard uh, drones, whatever they're called, to make them into mining ones. So if we click this four times, four will go in here, and they get reconfigured. Okay, so now we need to do a little bit of measuring. Put it in the excavation mode, and we have to highlight an area. So. 
We're gonna dig around the edge here. And we need to excavate 50 cells. So here we go. Okay, she's really sassy, this uh, Anna. Oh, Alice, sorry. It's 16 to 50. There we go. We are, we are digging. I love the little attention to detail. I look at the little drills. And we can't mine those ones yet. Maybe that's a tech we've not got access to just yet. So let's just keep mining around this little bit. And we just need to do 50 cells worth. Soon have this though. Nice. Basically another 10 to do now. Okay, distress call. Yeah, this is where it all goes wrong. Watch. Was not expecting this. This did make me go, wow. Okay. Luna has gone dark. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, I was not expecting that at all. I did like that. I did, I'm not going to lie. I did like that. That was good. Okay, I thought that was broken at the first time. It's just a transition scene between the end of the initial demo to loading in desolation mode. So as you can see, yeah, everything's looking a bit terrible. Everything's a bit broken. So now this is where we get into the meat and bones of the, the new world. Robert, come in, Robert. Do you read me? Okay. Data, Everything's gone wrong. Days. No survivors. We're still receiving a signal from the drone. Okay, so we need to repair Our the elevator. Okay, we need all the stuff again. Oh, you can't pause it and listen to the audio. So they don't know what's going on. Yeah, he's, he's chatty chatty. I'm not interested. Right, so we need to build up. So, um, module needs repair as well. So we'll click repair on that one. So there's various bits left on the surface that we can fix some of these things. And then... We can uh, build some more solar panels. Let's go to electricity and try and get some solar panels up and running. I think we can click on these and then click, oh, salvage research required. So we can't do that just yet. So let's build our own little independent panels then because we've done it before, we can do it again. So let's build four of these and we'll do batteries as well. So we'll do it similar to what we did last time. Do it like that. And then have some batteries. So we'll have, again, four. And then we'll collect, we'll connect it all up in advance. So if I do wires. You can change the game speed. Select the required speed using the yeah, we're playing, we're playing on standard at the moment. And then I'm gonna click these in advance. So these are all going to get built and then connected, which I think I think is really good that you can do it all in advance. We're also going to need a number of other things. We're going to need a charging station. And then that needs to be connected to all of that. Okay, so we've got power, power coming in. You can see here, 56 megawatts, and the batteries are slowly getting charged up now. Okay, and that's all getting, the, the batteries on those are getting low, but we're going to start charging stuff. So we have already fixed that. So we should be good. Yes, we're good. We're good. 
Not enough power to run the module, it says. Okay, so now we're going to find out what really happened. Okay, so it's all gone uh, wrong because of an asteroid. An asteroid's hit it. That is bad. Right, so we need to build a charging station, connect the modules. I think I've already done that one. We should be okay. Reconfiguration module connected. Right, let's go underground. This needs connecting. There we go. So something's going on. And they don't believe what's going on. Anyway, we've received your request for research projects. Let's finish the while lunar outposts. So I get to do research. How do we get steel and concrete? But we need both steel and yes. Start by Here we go. Ooh, get to do research now. Regolith's the uh, soil. Okay, allocate a mining area. Okay, so let's get a couple of miners on the go. Um, let's do like it said before and do five. And then we're going to allocate. Let's mine all of that. And we need to research this, this new techers. Research, regolith pressing. So we'll do that. That's going to be done in six days. Look at this. Look at the tech tree. Oh, so the demo cuts off here. Oh, what is some of this stuff, though? What is some of this stuff? Tell me your secrets. Oh, it doesn't show you, does it? It's just a vague thing. It could be anything. Looks like micro circuits, some sort of machinery, a press. Um, the latest we've got is increased yield by 50, conveyor belts. Programmable WIP distributor, electronics factory, rare elements factory. Oh, there's loads of stuff to research. Does look good. Now, right, we need to build a pressing module now. Okay, how do I do this then? Okay, that's what I'm mining underground. Oh. Where do I get that from then? Select geological exploration and we can proceed with our work. Once this research is completed, you'll Okay, I need an ore detector. We had prepared this research plan for the distant future, but we must adapt and work with it now. Where's the ore detector? Considering the circumstances, our best course of action at the moment is to salvage. I'd like that. Miraculously survived. Hmm. Surface scanner. I don't think... That's not an ore detector, though, is it? It said it was under geological. Um, wait a minute. I can't see it. Build the pressing module. It must be under engineering. Smelting. Oh, it's this one, isn't it? Geophysical prospecting. Okay, so let's try and build this thing now. This pressing module. So where is that? Production? No, I can't build... Oh, we need to be underground to build this. So let's build this pressing module. Um, I don't know where I need to build it though, so let's just put it... It's got an in and that, an in and an out. So we'll build it like that. They are all mining there. I reckon there's some stuff there. Look, scan it with the, with the ore scanner first. We've not got one, but we are going to have one soon. Okay, so that needs building. We need six units of steel, one component. And I'm going to... I want to do, I want to do more research and get that salvaged so I can grab all of that. 88% into researching that. 
that should be getting built now. Let's get the wiring hooked up. Perfect. All right. Now get the drones to build it. Okay, it's built. If I were you, and add a bulk resource storage to it, so your drones have a place to take the regolith they mined. Keep in mind that the detector contains ultra sensitive phased arrays, making it essential to Oh, so we need to build on the ground. Okay. It's not designed to withstand lunar dust and solar radiation. So we're going to build this ore scanner thing now. Um don't have a clue where about to this. Oh, look at all this though. I'm building like bars and canteens and stuff. Stuff. That's that's good. All right, so let's build our little ore detector here. There. Let's get the old wiring on. Let's connect you to you. Now we're already taking this stuff. Oh, they're all charging. Look. We need to figure out how to use this as well. I wanna I wanna do research though. I wanna get Where was the other thing? The salvage thing. I wanna get that. Plus twenty five percent speed. Hopefully we can just research that. Hopefully I don't break the tutorial just researching that. Okay, we have got bits and pieces. We have we have got little bits and pieces we're grabbing. This should be ready to get built soon. What are we going over here for? Oh look, there's all the raw component stuff here. Are we loading this machine up now? Is this making stuff? Looks like we're making our own smart concrete now, look. That is good. Okay, we can finally get this built now. That regolith is all on the floor there. Oh, yeah. We have to connect this up. There we go. Okay, let's scan then. How, how do I scan? It says minimum charge, 10,000. So select the ore detector and scan the regolith around it. Uh, you need to find the nearest iron vein and then excavate it. Using the detector that consumes battery power. I don't think it's connected to the power grid yet though, is it? Oh, well, we need to connect it to that one, I think. Let's, let's try and connect this grid thing up. So connect that to like that. So we're going to build a power thing. That apparently can't, I can't connect to anything else to that one. I feel like we need a little bit more power up here as well. Let's do some more of these things. I've got 31 of those, so I reckon we can get away with building some more of these. And also wiring them up. So if we daisy chain these like this. Should be fine. I've got I've got capacity for four hundred thousand, and that's what a hundred thousand. So let's do a little. Let's try and do a little scan now. So we'll activate it. Oh, I like that. It's got a spinny bit. I want to scan this stuff here right next to me. Yes. Okay. Although we haven't tested this theoretically, theoretically, sure that it's worth our whole enterprise is now one big. Okay, so we're gonna build a smelting furnace now. Have I actually got the techers to do that yet? A smelting furnace. No, we need to research it. So let's come into research. I always forget where research is down here. We need to do smelting. Smelting and processing. You can set your drone's priority zones for excavation. Okay, so you do a coloured red thing. We'll mine that bit first. That's interesting. So we're going to get smelting researched. 
Um, I'm going to get that done. So it's keep doing it in, in a one, two. I, I like that. That's really good. Okay, I want to start mining this stuff. Let's see if we can mine this stuff over here. So if I say mine that. So they are mining that ore around there, hopefully. And we're researching the uh, smelting thing as well. Okay, research doesn't seem to be doing a lot at the moment, though. Why are we not researching? Um... Should be doing smelting furnace now. Don't need to do any more scanning with that. We need to build that one. I think we are busy making lots of these bricks and stuff though. We've got 14 of them. So that's a positive income, I think. All the rest of them we are running out of stuff. Not good. Let's go to build. So I need a smelter. Research required. I don't understand why we're not researching it. I don't know if I've done something wrong. Um... No, that's turning it off. I don't know why it's not letting me research this. Because we've got the press. Well, are we researching it? I think it's 550 to unlock it. And then we get 200 a day. So, I guess while I'm waiting for that to do that I should really just be trying to mine lots of stuff should we do more scanning let's do a massive scan see what happens so you can see loads of the good stuff over here so we can mine all of this out like that I don't think I can mine that stuff yet, the red stuff. I don't think I have the techers to do it. Anyway, the more than mine, the more stuff we can produce. So I'm quite happy for them to carry on doing that. Got loads of iron on the floor. And we just need, need more research so smelting is going to take a day apparently according to that i mean we could just speed it up like that and these are going to start making an advancement into here okay so apparently i can now build the smelter so let's go to production and build the smelter here plonk it down and we're using our nice new bricks now as well so we've got 10 of those and we also need these bits components so they're taking them from the surface we've got we can store up to 64 in there as well which is good and we have the mining going on over there nice we need a little bit of building going on next so we're well on the way to building stuff so i'm gonna leave it there for now so let us save at this point. I'm going to call this episode one, a new mining hope. <laughs> That's terrible. Anyway, that is it. That's all I'm going to show you. This is the crust, as you can see. More than something I can fit in, like a 20 minute video. Quite a lot to look at. Does look rather exciting though. Anyway, let me know what you think of it. If you do want me to play some more of this, let me know. Hopefully I will be able to play it because I know it comes, I know it's unlocked to next fest. So hopefully 
Uh, it's not going to get locked out, otherwise I will cry. Anyway, that's it for now. And speaking of crying, actually, don't forget to like the video and thumbs up and drop me a sub. See you next time.